Welcome all. We just met a couple of minutes before in our common introduction with Vector. My name is Winfried Koch. I'm CEO of CSM Germany. I studied cybernetics at the University of Stuttgart and did my PhD there too. My wife Iris and I, she is an electrical engineer, founded CSM in 1986. The core competences of CSM are analog hardware, FPGA-based design and embedded software. I'm happy to present you now the new e-mobility measurement system, result of our partnership with Vector. At the end of this presentation, Thomas Schmeller, Head of Business Unit Measurement Technology from Vector, will take over for the Vector-specific part. E-mobility generates new requirements for developers in test stands and on the road. High voltages and currents have to be measured with high speed and at many places. See the yellow blinking spots. Power and efficiency analysis and validation of electrical wiring system are examples. Or During development of high-voltage batteries, multiple temperatures, vibration, strain, humidity have to be measured inside the battery. This motivated us to create the Vector CSM e-mobility measurement system. The overall e-mobility measurement system is a modular toolbox consisting of software and hardware for the development of electrical and hybrid vehicles. It contains a wide bandwidth of high-voltage safe and of conventional low-voltage measurement modules for acquisition of physical data, voltage, current, temperature, and so on. PC, software for data acquisition with the functionality of online processing of e-mobility data, interfaces for acquisition of bus data as well as ECU data, Embedded PC-based data loggers with same functionality of, as PC software. Compact energy-saving data loggers. Software for offline data analysis and cloud-based data management. That is the whole system. Core of the overall system is the so-called basic measurement system. The basic system alone is a powerful solution for measurement of data acquisition, visualization, online data processing and synchronization. All kinds of sensors are supported. Voltage, current, acceleration, strain, vibration, temperature, flow, humidity, pressure, torque, speed, frequency and so on. The system itself consists of breakout modules for measurement of voltage and current, EtherCAT high-speed mini-modules, high-voltage, low-voltage, and CAN mini-modules, high-voltage, low-voltage. Also, it consists of hardware for precise synchronization with gateway functionality and, of course, of a powerful PC-based data acquisition software with e-mobility analyzer functionality. This setup is scalable from a few sensors to hundreds of sensors. The same setup can be used in test stands and important as well as on the road. This is due to the excellent environmental specifications and the small size of the modules. Now measurement modules in detail. Let's start with measurement of high voltages and currents with breakout modules. Breakout modules are a very compact solution to measure voltage and current directly in high voltage power cables. If we get connectors, we can offer a plug and play solution, which you see here. Otherwise, The power cables are mounted inside the module with ring terminals. This you can see here, ring terminals. Current measurement is done with highly accurate shunt modules with high 
bandwidth. Here you can see shunt module. We can measure currents up to 800 amps nominal inner conductor currents and also we can measure the shield currents. We can measure voltages up to 2000 volt and this really high speed with data sending rates up to 1 MHz per channel using Ethercat. At the same time, data is sent via CAN in lower speed. The reason for this is to use CAN for data reduction in long-term applications, where high speed is not necessary. But if it is necessary, it is available. The breakout modules are laid out for use in test stands, but also on the road. See IP67 and from minus 40 to 125 degrees C operation. Learn more in our next session, electric vehicles, measurement applications and challenges. Let's switch to high speed measurement with EtherCAD modules. Two examples. We also can offer current measurement with conventional zero flux sensors, example with a CSM LEM sensor package or clamps connected to our high-speed EtherCAD modules. This is what you can see here. For measurement of high voltage itself, we offer a high voltage EtherCAD module. You can see it here. This allows also data sending rates up to 1 MHz per channel and a good synchronization. Why do we think High voltage breakout modules are in most cases a better solution. Please read our tech note or ask us. We see also an increasing need to analyze fatigue strengths of high voltage components. You can do this with our high voltage IEPE modules, which enable to measure acceleration, vibration, and shock with IEPE sensors inside high-voltage environments. Here you see a battery. In this battery instrumented is this IEPE sensor connected with a high-voltage safe cable which comes out of the battery to the module. You also can do this with strain gauge modules. They enable measurement of strain, acceleration and pressure with bridge-based sensors inside high-voltage environment. We support quarter, half and full bridges. I come now to measurements with data rates up to 2 kHz. This is the world of CAN modules. The CSM portfolio of CAN modules is huge. And for most of our conventional modules we can offer a high voltage safe version 2. Typical CAN based measurements for e mobility are temperature with thermocouples or RTDs or now with IC temperature sensors. Here you see a complete solution module and the sensors. This is a unique solution to measure many temperatures in areas where you have nearly no space, like in high voltage batteries. See our session tomorrow, battery thermal management. Next, new technology simplifies verification. Of course, you also can measure voltages with CAN and you can use standard sensors in high voltage environment to measure humidity, to measure pressure and others. Here you see sensors, here you see the high voltage safe modules, 19 inch one and a mini module one. And if you need to measure mechanical power, you can measure torque and rotational speed using our counter module. Now to our hardware for synchronization with gateway functionality. We call it XCP Gateway. 
This gateway synchronizes and bundles all measurement data coming from CSM EtherCAT modules and CAN modules and converts this data into XCP on Ethernet format. Why are we doing this? The EtherCAT protocol is getting more and more popular in test stands. The CSM EtherCAT modules speak it and can directly be used. XCP on Ethernet is widely used in the world of automotive control units and a common format for vector software and others. With this solution we support both worlds, test stands and on the road, very efficiently. The XCP gateway contains an EtherCAT master with time synchronization for all EtherCAT modules better than one microsecond, XCP on Ethernet slave with PTP time synchronization IEEE 1588. It contains one or four Ethercat ports, two CAN ports and one Ethernet port to PC. Now the final part of the basic system, which is also the bridge to the overall system, the data acquisition software vMeasure Expert. vMeasure Expert is very performant. For example, it allows real-time calculations of data sent with 1 MHz and many, many channels. All data sources except CAN are precisely time-synchronized and it has all the features which are mandatory for a modern data acquisition software. And here is the heart of vMeasure Expert, the e-mobility analyzer. The e-mobility analyzer is a function library which is optimally matched up with the CSM measurement modules. This allows real-time analysis of DC-AC voltages and currents, calculation of real apparent reactive power, power factor and efficiency, energy consumption, shaft axle power and much more, and important, all measurement data is also available for offline data processing. Learn more in the live demo e-mobility analysis with vMeasure Expert. Not always high-speed data acquisition and online calculation is required. There are applications like in endurance testing, an easy-to-handle data logger with server-based worldwide data access is suitable. For these applications, the Unicon 3 data logger is a good choice. It comes with 12 CAN or CAN-FD ports, Ethernet, LTE modem and Wi-Fi integrated, powerful software package for configuration and fleet management. It supports the protocols XCP on Ethernet, XCP on CAN, J1939 and others. It supports AutoSAR and it's extremely compact and low power. So far my presentation. Now Thomas takes over to explain further components of the e-mobility measurement system. Thank you for your attention. Thank you, Winfried. My name is Thomas Schmerler and I am head of the measurement tools and fleet logging business unit at Vector. You have now a first impression of the basic measurement system with the measurement modules, vMeasure Expert and the e-mobility analyzer. There will be detailed presentations on these topics. I now want to introduce the other components of the measurement system that makes this solution so flexible and so powerful. I will start with vMeasure Log. vMeasure Log is a high-end data logger designed for extreme data rates and the capability to handle all measurement tasks, triggering and real-time analysis, including the e-mobility analyzer functions. Like vMeasure Expert, the logger can handle analog measurements, signals from bus systems and control units, video, audio, GPS, all in one time synchronous recording. 
So if you want to make use of the e-mobility analyzer functions, but you don't want to have a laptop in your car, this is the solution. There's a dedicated presentation on vMeasure Log as well. Coming noon to a line of products where Vector is famous for. The strong family of network interfaces, all starting with the letters VN. I won't go into details, but if there is an automotive bus in your application, you can be sure that Vector has a device to measure it with, including, of course, CanFD, FlexRay and automotive Ethernet. You can just add these devices to your measurement setup and then you have access to all information on this bus in your measurement and recording. If vMeasure, for example, tells you while driving that there is an increased ripple on the electrical system, now you can look on the bus communication at that time and check what consumer was activated or which behavior has been changed. But the system does not stop there. Vector offers a large portfolio of devices that are designed to look inside a control unit. That gives you a maximum visibility and transparency of your system. These devices are of the VX family and they are designed to measure and calibrate values and parameters inside an ECU while it is in operation. This can be one ECU or several ECUs. The VX devices operate directly on the ECU memory or debug interfaces of an ECU. Now this gives you complete control. A simple example. If you want to measure or record in a road test values from within the battery management system ECU together with the actual physical voltages, currents and temperatures at the battery, let's say because you want to validate the temperature model running inside your battery management software. This is now very easy to do. As with the bus measurement, this is also time synchronous and part of the overall measurement. The measure handles analog measurements, bus signals and ECU signals, all in the same way that is easy for you to use. Now, that we can measure and record analog signals, bus signals and ECU data, it is time to look at what you can actually do with your data that you recorded. Vector offers two software products for data analysis and data management. vSignalizer is our solution for professional data analysis and data mining. It is designed to deal with measurement files that are potentially several gigabytes of size and can operate to analyze hundreds of thousands of files to generate a nice single reporting. VMDM, the Vector Measurement Data Management, is the cloud or server-based solution for professional and scalable data management. No matter how many vehicles you have in your fleet, and how many people are working together as a team. VMDM gives you full access to the data, performs automatic analysis tasks, and generates reports, basically gives you control. You will never have to search for data again. There is a dedicated presentation and demo for VMDM and vSignalizer as well. Now these were all the components of the basic measurement system, as well as the possible additions to make it even more powerful. Since we have dedicated presentations or demonstrations to most topics, please refer to the agenda to see when this will take place. Thank you all for listening. I hope you stay with us for all the other presentations and that you'd find them interesting and helpful. We will now start with the Q&A session.